we have some special guests with us today. We have every day is Saturday. We've been wanting to meet them for a long time and finally has worked out. I'm really looking forward to this. So y'all come along and join us as we all go into Archer's Barbecue and try out this barbecue place. Let's go check this place out. Notice they have lots of firewood out here ready to smoke the meat with. I see hickory, I see oak. Well, let's go inside Archer's Barbecue and see what it looks like on the inside. This is what the restaurant looks like as you pull in from the parking lot. And if you notice right here, they have a, a handicap ramp. So if you're in a wheelchair or cannot do steps, you can still get into this building mighty easy. And out here on the front porch they have tables available that you can sit at they got three tables and as you walk inside the restaurant this is what it looks like a nice fire pit i mean a fireplace this is a counter this is where you place your orders at and they also have a couple tables inside here's the menu for archer's barbecue Cindy, what did you get? I got the pulled pork barbecue sandwich, and mine is the regular. And I got some smoked mac and cheese. Can't wait to try this. I ended up ordering the barbecue sandwich. I got the large with a side of beans. You can see all the meat on that sandwich. They sure do put a lot of meat on it. All right, here's the two sandwiches side by side. Mine's on the left, that's the large, and Cindy's is on the right, which is a regular. So that'll give you an idea what the sizes of the sandwiches look like. If you look, you can see more with the, with the bun off to see the meat, to see the difference. Carla, she ended up getting the kids' milk. She got the ribs with the macaroni and cheese. And also it came with a slice of bread. Hey Jennifer, tell me what you got this evening. I got the pulled chicken plate and it comes with toast and then two sides. So I got collard greens and the sweet potato chips. That looks mighty good. Yes. Gentry, what did you end up getting today? I got the kids BBQ with mac and cheese. Brent, tell me what you got tonight. I ended up getting the Captain Almond's barbecue platter, barbecue sundae I should say, and down below it has barbecue baked beans, there's barbecue pork barbecue in between, and it had the option between coleslaw or uh, potato salad. I opted for the potato salad, and it came with a couple of pieces of bread here. That's a unique dish. I've never seen anything like that before. I have not either, but it looks delicious. And Henry, what did you get tonight, buddy? Macaroni with bread and cheese. Yours looks delicious, too. I can't wait for everybody to try it and see what you think about it. And I'm going to show you some of the barbecue sauces that are available. They have a Memphis, a Holy Jalapeno, a Moonshine, a Carolina Mustard, a KC barbecue sauce, and then the, the original and you notice on the original they have dolly parton's picture on the bottle and we are right here in sevilleville tennessee the home of dolly parton all right i've tried the different sauces and the three that i like the best are the original it's a little bit sweet not too sweet the holy jalapeno that's got a little bit of a kick to it i like that and then the memphis tasted like it had a little bit of a vinegar in it i guess so uh they're the top three that i like hey david what are you thinking so far well, I've tried several of the different sauces. 
I've tried the original, the Memphis, the KC, and the Moonshine. All of them have been good. I think the original, I've liked that the best. And like the KC barbecue sauce had a little bit of kick to it. And the other one with the holy jalapeno, I'm not gonna try because I can't eat hot stuff. So I'm gonna <laughs> leave that one alone. How about the beans, by the way? The beans are real good. Careful what you think so far. It is so good. Everything is full of flavor. Uh, the smokiness of the chicken is perfect. And the seasoning on there is really awesome. The collards have like a little slight kick to them and they're real tender. And then the sweet potato chips, they're cooked perfectly also, and they have a little bit of the barbecue seasoning on them that I really love. Gentry, what are you thinking about your ribs there? They're very hot. Are they? Did you try any of the different sauces on them? No. No. How about the mac and cheese? It's really cheesy. Hey Brent, what do you think about your meal so far? I've been very impressed with this. Uh, I want to talk about the sauces real quick. Uh, the sauces have a little bit of a kick to them, which was very surprising to me. Uh, when it comes to the sauces that I've tried so far, I'm just not brave enough to go for the jalapeno, but the original uh, really stood out to me, the Dolly Parton original. But when it comes to this meal, what I really enjoy about it is you have the heat from the beans, and of course, temperature-wise, the uh, pork barbecue, but then you've got the coolness from the potato salad, and I didn't quite know how this was gonna pair together, but I'm enjoying it. It's very good. I'm glad you're liking it. Henry, what do you think about your food, buddy? I see he ate, ate all his macaroni and cheese, so he must have liked that. <laughs> so good you're speechless. Hey, Carlin, what do you think about your meal so far? My food is really good. The mac and cheese, it was, very unique because it had a bit of a spice to it and that made it really good and it was also it wasn't like regular cheese it was like some other type of cheese uh -huh. which made it really unique too and then the ribs were also very delicious and they came with a slice of bread which was really good and i noticed you got something entirely different tonight than you normally get by getting the yes. ribs so i'm glad you like them Nice of those side of barbecue chips. Cindy, what have you thought about your food so far? I absolutely love the barbecue. It's got a great flavor. They absolutely know how to smoke it. It is delicious. Um, the sauces that I like the best are the holy jalapeno and then the Dolly Parton classic, of course. Carly, she decided she wanted to try the holy jalapeno sauce. And she's been warned, so if she gets set on fire, she can't be say we she can't say we didn't tell her. So try it and see what you think of it. I'm just throwing the cold thing in there. Okay. How is it? It's good. You like it? Now Carly has said this is not hot, so David thinks. So she has convinced me yeah, so he to, needs try. to try. It. Yes. Mm -hmm. Let's see. It's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Did you try enough of it? I did. Are you sure? Why don't you put a little bit more on it to make sure you get the real experience of it? This is what she did. Okay. I can taste a little heat, but it's not terrible. Okay. I think it's pretty tasty myself. Well, let's take a look at a receipt from the Archer's Barbecue. Cindy got the regular sandwich and added the smokehouse mac and cheese. Carter got the kid rib meal, a bag of chips. I got the large sandwich, added the baked beans. And here is the grand total at the bottom. With taxes and all, it came to $50.96. Here on the smoker, they have some chicken going on right now. It sure does look delicious. They have some t-shirts for sale here. Well, what did you guys think of Archer's Barbecue, David? Let's start with you. Okay, I thought my, everything I had tonight was very good. I enjoyed my, my sandwich. The barbecue was good. 
the baked beans, I really enjoyed those. They had a, a good flavor. And I enjoyed the sauces. I tried several different sauces. I like the Memphis. I like the original. I even tried that holy jalapeno. And really, it wasn't that hot. It had a little bit of a kick to it, but it was good. And I also enjoyed the KC barbecue sauce. But overall, all the sauces were good. My food was good. The only thing I could really say was I thought it was a little bit pricey, especially on my sides. For the price you pay for the side of baked beans, in my opinion, you, you didn't get a whole lot. And I, that's the only thing really negative I had to say. I thought it was a little bit pricey for what you did get. Now, how about you, Cindy? What did you think? I just want to say the barbecue was outstanding. I can see why it's won all kinds of uh, awards. Absolutely delicious barbecue. Uh, my mac and cheese could have been a little warmer. Um, that's the only complaint I have. Um, I loved all the different sauces um, that we tried, and they do everything here homemade. And all the recipes were the owner's or either the owner's ex-wife, I found out. So everything is made here with their recipes. And Carla, how did you enjoy your food? My food was very good. The mac and cheese had a very unique flavor to it. Like I said, like five times about now. It has a unique flavor, which makes it even better. And for the slice of bread that they gave up, that they gave me and um everyone else who got the rib, I think. Um was also good because it had that flavoring from the rib made it good. Now we had special guests with us tonight. We had every day Saturday. We very much enjoyed eating with Brent and his family. You know, the food was good, but the fellowship and the company was even better. And uh, They were probably wondering, well, we haven't left yet. They're probably wondering when we will leave because we just enjoyed talking with each other and the fellowship, and it's been amazing. It has been. And what did y'all think about y'all's food, Brent? So when it came to my meal, I will have to say, if you do not like your food touching, that was not a meal for you. But if you do, it, it was very, very delicious. And, I, I, again, going back to the... Temperature-wise, the, the, the heat from the bottom to the coolness of the potato salad, it was great. The only thing that I, I did not enjoy was the toast. I was really looking forward to garlic bread, but other than that, I would definitely order that once again. Okay, Jennifer, how did you enjoy your meal? I really enjoyed it. Um, the flavors were really great. The meat was moist and very full of flavor, and, and that good smoked flavor I really enjoyed. Uh, the Collards were really great, um, had a little bit of kick to them, which was not overpowering, uh, just went really well with the greens, and the sweet potato chips were really excellent as well. Okay. Gentry, how about you? Mac and cheese was very cheesy, and my ribs were just perfect. Well, that's good to hear. How about you, Henry? How did you enjoy your food, buddy? It was good, and I like the bread, the macaroni, and uh, the brisket. Well, it sounds like everybody pretty much enjoyed the food tonight, so I'm glad we decided to come here. And like I said, it was very nice to finally meet Brent and his family. We, we had a ball tonight hanging out with them and look forward to getting together with them sometime again soon and doing something else. So we hope you all enjoyed this video here from Archer's Barbecue in Sevierville, Tennessee. Go ahead and close this out, Carly. Make sure to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell so you won't miss our latest and greatest videos. See you next time. Thanks for watching. God bless. Thank you, everyone. Bye-bye.